It is officially President Trump's last full day in office. Tomorrow morning, he'll be leaving the White House and return to being a private citizen. As one of the most controversial presidents in modern history, the big question, of course, is what he's going to do next. So joining us now to talk about the many paths ahead for the soon-to-be ex-president is Tina Davis, executive editor for Bloomberg's legal news coverage. So, Tina, let's dig right in, because Trump has been anything but a conventional president, and he's not going to tomorrow's inauguration, but he did release a farewell address today. What's the gist of it? Is it conventional? Well, he put out a 20-minute video on YouTube, so if you consider that conventional, then yeah, sure, <laughs> we'll, we'll count that as, as his convention. Um, look, this is a president that has never uh, conceded this election. The speech that he gives, as I said, is a scripted speech, a uh, scripted video, so um, it's a chance for him to kind of give his goodbye address, if you will, to the nation. Um, what he does in the course of that, he does talk about there being the inauguration of a new administration, so there is some acknowledgement there that uh, that Joe Biden won the election and is going to be inaugurated tomorrow. Um, but the bulk of the message is celebrating the successes of his administration. He briefly mentions COVID and the lives lost to that disease. But again, he does it in the terms of describing how quickly his administration was able to get a vaccine out to folks. So again, it's not a it's not a normal concession speech, but this is a president who who's never adhered to any of the norms of his office, and mm -hmm. he continues to do that on the way out. The biggest stories, the moment they happen from around the globe. Subscribe to Bloomberg Quick Take now for insight in an instant.